Hello and welcome to my crochet channel. Today I have a thread crochet project to share with you. This is a lacy trim that I made using crochet cotton thread size 10 and a hook size 1.5 millimeters. My trim came out three and a half inches wide. It's a bit too wide for a bookmark, but I'm sure there are lots of other projects that this lacy trim can be useful for. For example, one thing I can think of is making this trim and adding it to pillowcases. That would look very pretty and romantic. There are 10 repeating rows in the pattern and you can make this lace trim as long as you wish. But before we start working on this project, I want to share with you that I recently changed my Instagram name from Opoltava to Olga Poltava Crochet because I think that way it will be easier for people to find me on Instagram. And I try to become more active on Instagram. I try to share crochet projects daily. And I invite you to check out my Instagram account and perhaps even follow me there. Again, my name on Instagram is Olga Poltava Crochet. Thank you. And if you love thread crochet as much as I do, I invite you to check out my doily patterns in my Etsy shop. Over the past few years, I've designed several doilies. And if any one of them catches your attention, I'm happy to share a coupon code with you for 20% off. Simply use the coupon code YouTube20 at the checkout and you will get a 20% discount. Thank you. I start with 29 chains. one two three here i have 29 chains and i'm ready to start my first row into the first chain from the hook i will make a double crochet we never count the chain on the hook we always start counting from the next chain one two three four so over here i make a double crochet now these three skipped chains will count as my first double crochet and now I will make a double crochet into each chain across. That's it. My first row is simply a row of double crochets. So this is my first row. It's just a row of double crochets and the total amount is 27 double crochets. Now I'm ready to start next row. So I make three chains and turn. And these three chains will count as a first double crochet in this row and in every following row. Now I'm going to make a double crochet in each of the next 12 double crochets. So I don't make a double crochet into the first one because three chains count as the first double crochet and starting with the second double crochet, that's where I start crocheting. So I make 12 double crochets. Here I made 12 double crochets and with the starting chain 3 that's 13 in total. Next I make one chain, I skip one double crochet and I make a double crochet into the next double crochet. And now until the end of this row I simply make a double crochet into each double crochet. Here is my second row finished, so I have 13 double crochets over here, then I have one chain and one skip double crochet, and then I have 13 double crochets over here as well. For the next row, I start with chain 3 and turn. And now I will make a double crochet into each of the next 10 double crochets. One. Here I made 10 double crochets and I have two left. I'm going to skip them. I make three chains, one, two, three, and into this chain one, I make a single crochet. Now again, I make three chains, one, two, three, and I skip the next two double crochets, and into the next double crochet, I make a double crochet, and I finish this row with a double crochet into each of these double crochets. Here I have three rows finished. For the next row I start with three chains and turn and I make a double crochet into each of the next eight double crochets. Here I made eight double crochets and I have two left. Now I make four chains. One, two, three, four. I skip these 
two double crochets and over here I have three chains so I'm going to skip the first one and the second one and into the third chain I make a single crochet next I make a single crochet into the next single crochet and now I make a single crochet into the first chain of this chain three Now again, four chains, one, two, three, four, and I'm going to skip two double crochets and I make a double crochet into the next one and a double crochet into each double crochet across. Here is what I have so far. This is four rows. Now I start row five with three chains and turn and I make a double crochet into each of the next six double crochets one here I made six double crochets and I have two left now I make one chain and I skip next double crochet and into the next double crochet I make a double crochet now over here I have four chains and I make a double crochet into the first chain and into the second chain. Next I make three chains one, two, three and over here I have three single crochets. I'm going to skip the first one and I make a single crochet into the second one. Now again I make three chains one, two, three and over here I have four chains. I'm going to skip the first one, the second one, and into the third one I make a double crochet. And also into the fourth one I make a double crochet. Next I make a double crochet into the next double crochet. Then I make one chain and I skip the next double crochet. And I make a double crochet into the next double crochet and then I make a double crochet into each double crochet until the end of this row. Here I have five rows complete and I start my next row, row six with three chains and turn and now I make a double crochet into each of the next four double crochets. One, two, three, and four. And I have two double crochets left. Now I make three chains, one, two, three. I skip these two double crochets and into the next chain one, I make a single crochet. Now again, three chains, one, two, three. And I skip the next two double crochets and make a double crochet into the next double crochet. Next I have three chains over here and I make a double crochet into the first chain and into the second chain. Then I make one chain. I skip this next single crochet and over here I have three chains again. I skip the first one and I make a double crochet into the second one and into the third one. And I make a double crochet into the next double crochet. Next I make three chains, one, two, three and I skip these two double crochets and I make a single crochet into the next chain then three chains I skip the next two double crochets and I make a double crochet into the next one and a double crochet into each double crochet until the end of this row I start row 7 with 3 chains and turn and I make a double crochet into each of the next 2 double crochets 1, 2 and I have 2 double crochets left over here but I'm going to skip them and now I make 4 chains 1, 2, 3, 
four. And over here, this chain three, I skip the first one, the second one, and into the third chain, I make a single crochet. Then I make a single crochet into the next single crochet. And I make a single crochet into the first chain of the next chain three. Now four chains, one, two, three, four. I skip this chain and I skip two double crochets and into the next double crochet I make a double crochet. Into the next chain I make a double crochet. Then into the next double crochet I make a double crochet. Now again four chains, one, two, three, four. I skip two double crochets and I skip two chains and into the third chain I make a single crochet. Then I make a single crochet into the next single crochet and I make a single crochet into the next first chain. Now again four chains, one, two, three, four. I skip these remaining chains and I skip two double crochets and into the next double crochet I make a double crochet. And then I make a double crochet into each of the next two double crochets. One, two and this row is finished. I start row 8 with 3 chains and turn and I make a double crochet into each of the next 2 double crochets. 1, 2. Now over here I have 4 chains and I make a double crochet into the first chain and also a double crochet into the second chain. Next 3 chains. 1, 2, 3. I skip these remaining chains and I skip the first single crochet and into the second single crochet I make a single crochet. Now again three chains one two three I skip the next single crochet and I will make a double crochet into the third and fourth chain of this next chain four. So into the third chain and then into the fourth chain. Now I make a double crochet into each of these three double crochets. One, two, three. Over here I have four chains and I make a double crochet into the first one and a double crochet into the second one. Next I make three chains, one, two, three. I skip these remaining chains, I skip the first single crochet and into the second single crochet I make a single crochet. Now three chains, one, two, three. I skip this single crochet. Over here I have four chains and I make a double crochet into the third chain and also a double crochet into the fourth chain. And I end with a double crochet into each of the three remaining double crochets. One, two, And I have eight rows and this is what it looks like so far. I start row nine with three chains and turn and now I make a double crochet into each of the next four double crochets. One, two, three, four. And I will also make a double crochet into the next chain the first chain of the next chain three and into the second chain of the chain three then one chain I skip the next single crochet 
and I and over here I have three chains I skip the first one and make a double crochet into the second one and also into the third one next over here I have seven double crochets and I will make a double crochet into each one of them one and seven next I make a double crochet into the next chain the first chain of the next chain three and also double crochet into the second chain then one chain I skip single crochet and over here I have chain three I skip the first chain and into the second chain I make a double crochet and I also make a double crochet into the third chain now over here I have five double crochets left and I will make a double crochet into each one of them. I start row 10 with three chains and turn and I will make a double crochet into each double crochet. And over here I have one chain and I will make a double crochet into this chain. And then I will continue making a double crochet into each double crochet across and over here I have another one chain and I will also make a double crochet into that chain so this is my row 10 just a row of double crochets and the total should be 27 double crochets and I'd better check my stitches 2 4 6 8 10 12 14 16 18 20 22 24 26 27 the next row row 11 is very easy chain three and turn and then i make a double crochet into each double crochet across and here i finished my row 11 and this is what it looks like and from this point the pattern begins to repeat we will repeat from row 2 through row 11 Thank you for watching, I hope you enjoyed this video tutorial and I will see you in the next one.